Hello guys, what is up? My name is Gemnoja5000 and um, I'd like to say just like today I'm going to be showing you how, well not exactly how to make a uh, slender game on like um, on our scratch but I'm just going to show you some of the things, basic things I've done to create this, well, scratch project. Um, yeah. So, if you want to play this game, I've uploaded it to uh, Scratch, well I should have done I think, I'll double check, but um, I'll have the link in the description below if you wish to check it out there, and um, yeah, obviously for you guys who know Scratch you probably know what I'm talking about, but alright, well, I'm just going to quickly show you what the sprites I've used. Um, So, start off you need like all of this, obviously when flag is clicked, so that's when it's like the game's going to start, and um, just all these things here, you can get that from variables, and scroll x and scroll y, I don't know what that's for but you just need it, um, and uh, all of this as well, all of that, just take a good look guys. But um yeah. Set brightness effect as blah 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 blah. When flag is clicked forever, blah 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 blah. So it does require kind of a lot of uh stuff. This is for the player by the way. So yeah, the, the player is probably the hardest bit to do. But um it's um pretty simple. Um, so, oh sorry, <laughs> so you obviously want forever and uh, point towards the thingy, but well, whatever. Okay, so this is enough for our uh, play thing. If you want to like copy the same sprites, then just like pause it and um, copy it from there. But um, let's go. For the light, not much here. Oh, I'm sorry, I couldn't include any static or, um, like, static or, uh, death in this game. Um, I just haven't found a way of doing it. If you know how to do it, just tell me in the comment section below. And, um, yeah. And I'll probably subscribe to you, <laughs> but who cares. Right. Sorry, guys, I'm eating fries. <laughs> um... So blah, blah 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 blah. Really not much here for the flashlight. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah. Um. So yeah, not much here. Just a few basic stuff. And uh, now we move on to the slender, which also isn't thing people. So obviously, when flag is click, and you want it to touch the light. So it, when the light goes in every direction. Slender Man will follow it. Set brightness effect to 25. Um, else, set brightness effect to blah 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 blah. blah. And just, we want it to point towards the player as well. So, like, yeah. But uh, anyway, I think that's enough for the sprites. And uh, let's get started. So, as you can see, there is no like proper death or anything, but I have a decent slender kind of scratch game. And the player moves and Slenderman follows me. You probably won't want to play anything like this, I'm just showing you a tutorial if you want to make a slender game. This would be the best option. Okay, literally I have no idea what scroll X and scroll Y are. Probably some error thing, but <laughs> yeah, but yeah, okay. So, the further we get away from the Slender Man, like the blacker he becomes, and when we touch the light on him, obviously, he becomes white, and all of that, yeah. Well, uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, leave a comment below, and I shall see you in the next video. Peace out.